Greetings my friends, how are you all doing? This is Zed from Zed Outdoors. I hope you're having an awesome day. Well today is definitely an awesome day in London. The sun is shining and spring is definitely here. Which has made a change from the pretty atrocious weather we've been having in recent weeks and in recent months. So, this video is a continuing series called Great Bushcraft Channels. And these are basically channels that I watch online and that I want to recommend to you guys. Because there will be a lot of you that may be not aware of these channels that I'm going to recommend. So I recommend these channels for a variety of reasons. And so these next three that I've picked are people that I've gotten to know personally. Two I've met in person on a couple of occasions over the past two and a half years I've been into the bushcraft scene. And the third one I've yet to meet but we've been keeping in touch quite a bit. So without further ado let me bring you three bushcraft channels that I recommend to you. So the first channel I want to recommend to you is by a good friend of mine, Brian Trubshaw, and his channel is called Outdoors Life of Brian. Now he's based in the Midlands here in the UK, and um, I met Brian kind of pretty much when I first started out. He's one of the first channels that I started viewing before I even set up my own channel. And we've become good friends over time, you know, sharing a lot of information. We've met up on a couple of occasions. Uh, we actually have a wild camp pl uh, planned, I think, for later in the year, if that goes to plan. And Brian is an awesome guy. He's literally outdoors quite a bit at the time. In recent times, he's been going out with his partner, and um, he's one of those guys that's just always doing stuff here in the UK and abroad. I know he's done expeditions out in Europe, and even this year, he has a lot of stuff planned. And Brian puts an incredible amount of detail into the way he films his videos. He puts a lot of attention to detail. He gets very creative the way he does stuff. The key thing being with Brian is that he's always out. He's always doing stuff. And he's got a good backlog of videos. Um, he's one of those guys I look at and I think, yeah, you know what? He's doing some great, great stuff. So that is a channel called Outdoors Life of Brian that I highly, highly recommend you check out. The next channel I want to recommend is another good friend of mine, Billy Sotir. He's also based in the Midlands here in the UK and he's got a channel called Wandering in the Wild. Him and Brian, who I just mentioned, uh, they kind of got their own little clique based out in the Midlands. They kind of all roughly started out at the same time and they've done a lot of camping out together. And Billy, once again, was the same kind of group of guys that I got to know very early on uh, in the stage when I started out in Bushcraft and also my YouTube channel. Now, I've actually done a wild camp video um, going back, I think it's almost two years now uh, that I've done a video with Billy. Um, we camped out for, I think, one or two days. It was a very well received video and it's something that people enjoyed a lot. And I owe a lot of thanks to both Brian and Billy. They've taught me a lot of stuff. Billy really helped me out with the natural fire lighting. Billy's kind of more focused on primitive skills. Brian's kind of focused more on kind of the hiking, the bushcrafty kind of generic stuff um, and kind of getting out there, kind of exploring different avenues. Billy's kind of more kind of honed in and focused on the more primitive living skill side of things. He's honestly one of the most talented guys I know when it comes to primitive skills, especially stuff like hand drill and bow drill. I kind of owe it to him that he helped me kind of in my early days, especially if you watch that video on my channel, where he helped me out with my kind of uh, skill set in the beginning, because it was pretty poor, you know, with natural fire lighting and tinder bundles and all that stuff. So spending time with Billy really helped me out, kind of get nailed down on that. So Billy, like I said, is someone who doesn't put out as many videos as maybe Brian does, uh, but when he does put stuff out, like I said, it's really, really good stuff. He puts a lot of attention to detail, the way he kind of films, the way he records. And like I said, he's just one of the most chilled out guys you'll ever meet. Um, so Billy Sote has got a channel called Wonder in the Wild. He's the second channel that I recommend. Now, before I move on to the third channel, there's one quick thing I want to say, and that's the thank you to both Brian and Billy. You see, when I started out at the beginning with my YouTube channel, um, them guys helped me out a lot. You know, they, uh, they, I think they took part in my first ever 100 subscriber giveaway. Look at that, man, we all start from humble beginnings. So they too uh, done a VR for that, and they really pushed it out there. And because of them, they really helped my channel grow quite a bit. So I never forget things like that. So this is just a public thank you to both Billy and Brian. Um, Sound like a couple of puppets in it, Billy and Brian, right? But Billy and Brian, I want to thank both of you uh, for supporting me a lot personally and through my channel. So like I said, the second channel is Wandering the Wild. And last but not least, another good friend of mine, Peter, and his channel is called Forrester Bushcraft, or as I like to call him, the Fozmeister. Or when it's Valentine's, I call him Fozzy Bear with an XXX. So Forrester Bushcraft, another awesome guy. I believe he's based out in the northwest of England. Now I come to know of Peter, I think last year, I think last year is roughly when he pretty much started his channel, I believe. Um, and he's another awesome guy who's always out there. I think he's starting to work now full time in the bushcraft space. Um, but he's starting to hang around with Brian quite a bit now. I know they're doing a lot of expeditions together, hikes. I believe they're doing a hike across Hadrian's Wall, which is kind of 
um, what, the, what the Romans built to keep out the rowdy Scots, right? Up north, so it's the Hadra is always quite a long walk actually. And uh, I know them two have got it, uh, and, and another guy as well, I think they've got it planned for the next couple of months they're going to be doing that. So Peter is another awesome guy I got to know last year. Another one who puts an incredible amount of work into his videos, as do the other two. Someone who puts a lot of care and attention in terms of what he delivers and what he talks about. He's got a lot of skill set, as the other two do also. Um, and like I say, it's just a real joy to watch, you know, as are both Brian and Billy. Um, so Peter Forrester Bushcraft, he's got a good backlog of videos. Um, he's just a real personable guy, he presents well on uh, camera. Uh, and he's another one I thoroughly enjoy and I think you're going to enjoy too. So that third and final channel is called Forrester Bushcraft. So there you have it my friends, another three channels that I thoroughly recommend to you. The first one, Outdoors Life of Brian. Second. Wandering the Wild and third, Forest of Bushcraft. All three are amazing guys. They're young guys too, so they're quite inspirational in terms of for that young age getting out and doing a lot of stuff. And like I said, all three for different reasons, you know, they just make great viewing. But the thing they all have in common, they put a lot of work into their videos, they have a great skill set, they have a great demeanor, and also they just get out and they're doing a lot of stuff. Needless to say, I'm gonna put the links to the three channels below in the description, just below this video. Click, click, click on those links and like I said, go and check them out hit the subscribe button, let them know that I sent you over and just devour their content. All three have a backlog of a lot of content and I know you're thoroughly going to enjoy it just like I enjoy watching them too. And like I said, all three are just really good guys. I hope to meet up at some point within the coming months if all goes to plan. So there you go. Hope you enjoy this video. I hope you enjoy what you see on their channels. And as always, I hope whatever you do, you have a blessed day, a blessed week ahead. Zed trying to talk louder when this, flight, <laughs> when this plane's going above me. As always, this is Zed from Zed Outdoors. Peace out.